So your overall tracks, you get four, four banks, whatever you want to call them. Each bank has its own uh, slider. So keep in mind that you can already tweak each individual pad level volume here and here. But then you can also go to the mixer and tweak the overall volume of that particular drum kit. Um, you can mute it. Very intuitive. Um, you can tweak the volume several, several different ways. Um, and so uh, keep that in mind um, if you're a tweaker like me. I create my own drum kits. Uh, I need every instrument to do what I want it to do. And I need to give each instrument its own creative voice. And so uh, this particular product allows me all of that free range. Alright, um, iMachine. What else about iMachine? You get two effects. Uh, if I highlight that effect, effects one is on the uh, lower part of the screen. You can always go back to the mixer just in case if you get lost. Um, the effects include, of course, a lo-fi filter, a delay filter, a flanger filter, um, a low-pass filter, a uh, high-pass filter, and I forgot what the B stands for. We'll call it a bypass filter, <laughs> but it's not a bypass filter. I shouldn't have said that. Scratch that. Uh, just experiment around with those uh, filters. Um, sometimes they suck and sometimes they're just really great. Um, not going to uh, experiment with these particular effects until I get into the beat making phase. So make sure you subscribe. Keep saying that over and over. Um, and you'll, you'll get a chance to see that. Sorry if I'm not holding the phone straight. This is kind of uh, like chewing gum and walking at the same time. Alright, so. Da -da 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 -da, two effects. I'll go back to the mixer so you can see that screen. Each track can have up to two effects highlighted. Okay? It's not a wide range. Again, this is not a DAW. This is just a notepad. Alright? So I'll go back to the screen for the actual track and kit in bank A. And remember that the kit in bank A corresponds to this in B it responds to this in C it responds to this alright so there's two ways that you can get back to your bank screen you can hit the mixer again or you can hit the corresponding highlighted bank button alright so uh, I'll go over keys a little bit these are chromatic keys chromatic scale. Um, when I get into iMachine 2, um, it's a little bit more in depth because they tweaked the, oh man, they blew the lid off of this thing, but I'm not going to get into that yet. Um, just pay attention. So uh, up here you have the uh, transpose function. Uh, C1 is the first note here. You can go all the way down to C2 and then you can take it all the way up to C6 and so that's really intuitive too in uh, creating your sounds um, and also bringing out uh, the octave of a song that you a sound that you want for a particular beat or song uh, some samples just sound better within a certain range and uh, you just have to have that uh, what else about the keys so inside of the uh, keys function it's pretty much the same as the pad function um, except uh, let's see what's the difference here uh, you can do one shot and you can also trigger when you make uh, this a mono sample um, it uh, decreases the stereo range and so keep that in mind you can also uh, record your own sound through your um, iPhone mic and play it across the keys or load it onto a pad as a sample. Let's hit record. Let's lower the re recording volume. One, two, one, 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 one,
and so you can save that uh, we'll make a new folder wait go back we'll make a new folder and call it one done one and done save sample yes we'll call this sample one as well and the sample is saved one one now we can go to the edit function one one and we can pitch it one you can use the note repeat function and set up uh, the default level one, one, to be one. as high or as low as you want same here one panning one 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 one, one. Um, there's no automation um, as far as uh, motorized memorization so once you pan something that's where it is and that's where it's going to stay um, what else? I think I'm gonna keep that sample too. Transpose that. That sounds pretty cool. So, um, let me get into the top menu. So, up top, you have your main menu.